car break-ins, alcohol use, and dogs off-leash are all some of the problems being reported at the Barton Springs Spillway just below Barton Springs Pool. KXAN's David Yeoman shows us how Austin police plan to crack down and the changes you need to prepare for. For years, Austinites have been coming to the Barton Springs Spillway to cool off during the hot summer months, even affectionately calling the place Barking Springs because you can bring your dog. But APD says that is exactly what's leading to some problems. Marissa Mingi's visits to the Barton Springs Spillway started when she was just a kid. Instead of going to Barton Springs, I come here because I have dogs. I always feel bad going swimming when I don't have them with me. Just a few weeks ago, Marissa brought her four-month-old puppy to the spillway to teach it how to swim. So everybody had their dogs on their leash and like tried to like play fetch with them when they had their leashes on. But she decided to take a chance. APD officers saw her dogs off leash and issued her four tickets, two dogs at large and two unvaccinated since she didn't have their rabies tags on. And the tickets didn't come cheap. About $200. Austin police say that off-leash dogs aren't the only problem. We've had a large amount of thefts of personal property where people will leave their wallet or their cell phone or electronic device that's been getting stolen. As police crack down on the leash law and other ordinances, Marissa and her pups are feeling the change. This dog wants to run as far as she can to chase a tennis ball, and she came here knowing that she was going to do it, and then I had to keep her on a leash, and she was like, I don't know what to do. Now it is important to note that alcohol is still allowed here, but as of September 2nd, it will be banned. We're at Barton Springs. David Yeomans, KXAN News. One reason for the crackdown at the spillway is an increase in crime. We asked police for crime reports for the park area. The most common crimes are car break-ins and thefts. Nearly 90 of those reports since the start of this year. We also checked crime reports in the past month using APD's online crime tracker. The images inside the gray circle show crimes in the half-mile area around Barton Springs Pool since July the 6th. For some perspective, you can see many more labels in the downtown area, signifying a higher number of crimes in that part of Austin as compared to Zilker Park.